Well, today we're beginning Law Week here at KHUN2. Legal questions answered for free later today. Every morning on Take Two, we'll tackle a legal issue. Right now, we're joined by bankruptcy attorney Blake Goodman to talk about consumer and bankruptcy law. Good morning and welcome. Good morning, Christine. Thanks for having me. Now, the word bankruptcy, it can strike fear in someone and it can be really intimidating. So tell us a little bit more about when's a good time to file. You know, Christine, people file bankruptcy because it looks like it's the end of their rope. Um, there are no other options in order to keep food on the table, a roof over your head. Uh, there's just so much a buildup and pressure from creditors that it is time to do something other than keep running in a, in a circle that's spiraling downward. Is it as scary as it sounds? You know, it, 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 it isn't. It, it, it is, of course it's scary out there mm -hmm. for the layperson, but filing bankruptcy is a pretty procedural kind of paperwork shuffle. Um, you're 99% you're, you're of the time you're not going to lose any assets. That's the big scary wow. thing. Yeah, it's very, very few cases in the United States where any assets are lost. So it's really just your creditors that get either erased or reorganized and your assets and everything else are, are uh, remain intact and your income and all that stuff. So it's really not that scary. So that goes the same for a business bankruptcy as well as a consumer individual bankruptcy? <laughs> Well, there, there's big business bankruptcy. It's called the Chapter 11, which mm -hmm. is a reorganization plan. And no, the idea behind that is not to lose assets either, but to reorganize. And in the consumer cases for the individuals and the smaller businesses, um, uh, once again, there's not many assets that are lost. It's, it's, it's not a scary process. And we steer you through all that stuff anyways. Because even if you owe money on your house or your car, you won't lose those either if you file for bankruptcy? Those are so called secured claims. There's liens on them. If, if you file bankruptcy, no, you're not going to get a free car and a free house by erasing the debt. You've got to pay those payments off mm -hmm. in order to keep the collateral. But as well, you could surrender them. In other words, I, I can't afford my car. I want to give it back. The debt is erased as well as you don't get the car anymore if you right. don't make the payments. Uh, but but you the don't pressure's lose off. those things. The pressure's, the pressure's off. off. Right? That's right. Okay. That's right. So key things to remember when you file is that you actually don't lose what you think you might lose. Mm -hmm. Not going to um, lose? Your credit is the one that's really affected through all of this. You know, the answer to that question is yes. It's mm -hmm. on your credit report for 7 to 10 years if you file bankruptcy, but that does not mean you don't get credit in 7 to 10 years. It's an uphill climb typically for people to rebuild themselves. And when you look at it, most people come to me, their credit's already shot. And mm -hmm. as a matter of fact, as ironic as it sounds, bankruptcy is going to clean the slate and actually improve your credit quicker because you get this fresh financial start. And so the effect on your credit sometimes is very good news too. And to rebuild your credit? Credit, what is your suggestion? Well, we plug our clients into one of our services is give that we, we plug them into a credit rebuild system, which is a series of instructional emails that I give them every week. And if they follow my little steps, mm -hmm. they'll get back on their feet. But it all has to do with reestablishing your credit with small credit cards, knowing how to use those credit cards correctly, and you get back on your feet in a matter of years typically. It's not forever. All right. Blake Goodman, thank you so much for all that advice and just for breaking it down for us because, again, bankruptcy can be really scary. And you might think it's very complicated, but you can file and things can be okay if you work to rebuild your credit. Thanks for being Thank here. Thank you, Christine. Yes. All right. Well, be sure to call in today with your legal questions on consumer and bankruptcy law. They're taking those calls between 11 a.m. and 1 p.m. That number to call right there on your screen, 5910222. And remember, it's all free.